friends, I'm Miss Katie. I work at the Fleming Island Public Library. Welcome to Virtual Storytime. Now in Storytime, we get to read books and sing songs, get silly, learn some cool new stuff. But first, let's sing our welcome song. So I'd like you to get your hands ready for clapping so we can sing. The more we read together, 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 the more we read together, the happier we'll be. Read big books and small books and short books and tall books. The more we read together, the happier we'll be. All right, friends. So this summer, our theme is tales and tales. Those two words sound completely alike, right? But this one is tales like what animals have. And this one is stories like fairy tales. So for story time, each week we are going to visit a habitat, an animal habitat. That is where animals live. So this week we're going to the grasslands. Now the grasslands have a few trees, a little bit of water, but for the most part they have grass. However, it's not the same kind of grass that we have in our yards. The grass in our yards is kind of short and it's green, right? In the grasslands, the grass is a lot taller, so animals can hide behind it, and it's mostly brown. So, one of the animals that lives in the grasslands is a zebra. So we're gonna learn how to say zebra in sign language. That's when we talk with our hands. So what we're gonna do for this sign is we're gonna take one hand and we're gonna start on one side, and we're gonna draw our zebra stripes. So it starts here and goes across. That's zebra. So we just draw our stripes on. All right, great job. So our book is about another animal that lives in the grasslands. This is a hippo. So this book is called Kiss Kiss. It's by Margaret Wilde and Bridget Strevens Marzo. One day, when Baby Hippo woke up, he was in such a rush to go and play that he forgot to give his mama a kiss. <gasps> oh, no. oh, said Mama. Through the squelchy, squelchy mud waddled Baby Hippo, and this is what he heard. What do you think he heard? <gasps> kiss, kiss. <gasps> what animal is that? That's an elephant. Then around the bumpy, bumpy rocks waddled Baby Hippo, and this is what he heard. Kiss, kiss, can you make kisses? Kiss, kiss. Up the mossy, mossy bank waddled Baby Hippo, and this is what he heard. What do you think he heard? Kiss, 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 kiss. Through the long, long grass waddled Baby Hippo, and this is what he heard. Kiss, kiss. That's the animal we just learned in sign language. Can you do your sign language again? Zebra? All right. Under the leafy, leafy trees waddled Baby Hippo, and this is what he heard. Kiss, kiss. Baby Hippo stopped. He suddenly remembered something he'd forgotten to do. Baby Hippo hurried back under the leafy, leafy trees, through the long, long grass, down the mossy, mossy bank, around the bumpy, bumpy rocks, through the squelchy, squelchy mud to find his mama. But he couldn't see his mama anywhere. Oh, said Baby Hippo. Then out of the deep, deep water appeared two eyes, two wiggling ears, and a pair of snorting nostrils. Can we snort like the hippo? <laughs> Peekaboo, said Mama. Baby hippo beam. Kiss, kiss, he said. Kiss, kiss, said Mama. That's the end. Can we blow kisses? Kiss, 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 kiss. All right, so hippos, when they live in the grasslands, they usually hang around the water. Now the water in the grasslands is usually called a lagoon. Can you say that word with me? Lagoon. So this is my lagoon. 
And we're gonna have some hippos that are gonna go for a swim. So we're gonna start with the first one, but every little hippo that we have is going to knock, knock, splash, splash, and they're gonna ask another friend to come in. Are you ready? So let's start with, hmm. Let's start with this friend. What color is this one? This one's yellow. So we have one hippo in the lagoon going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. Come on in. Let's see, what other color? Let's invite our red friend in. So how many do we have? One, two hippos in the lagoon going for a swim. Knock, knock. Let's see, what other friends can we have? How about our blue friend? So now we have one, two, three hippos in the lagoon going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Let's invite another one. How about our purple friend? So now we have one, two, three, four hippos in the lagoon going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. So let's invite one more. How about our orange friend? I think we can fit her right down here. So now we have one, two, three, four, five hippos in the lagoon going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, we're all in. All right. So one more animal that I would like to talk about today that lives in the grasslands is a very tall animal with spots. We are going to act like giraffes. So first, can we get tall? And then let's get on our tippy toes and get even taller. And then we can talk about how we eat leaves from the trees. Mm, mm, mm. And how we can run with ease. <laughs> All right, so. I'm a big tall giraffe stretching way up high. A big tall giraffe, I almost touch the sky. I eat leaves from the tallest trees. Mm -mm -mm. And I run through the fields with ease. I'm a big tall giraffe stretching way up high, way up high. All right, <laughs> let's try that one one more time. I'm a big tall giraffe stretching way up high. I'm a big tall giraffe, I almost reach the sky. I eat leaves from the tallest trees, mm, 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 and I run through the fields with ease. I'm a big tall giraffe stretching way up high, way up high. All right, good job guys. All right, so that is all the time we have for virtual story time today. But first, let's sing our goodbye song. So I love to sing Skinnamarink at the end of my story times. So we're gonna start by putting one hand down, and then we're gonna put one hand over it, and we're gonna wave. And then we're gonna switch hands. And then we get to say, I love you. How do we say that? We point to our eyes for I, we give ourselves a big hug for love, and we point to each other for you. So when do we love? We love in the morning when the sun's nice and high. We love in the afternoon. We love in the evening when the sun's low. And then when the moon comes up. All right, ready? Skin a marinky dinky ding, skin a marinky do. I love you. Skin a marinky dinky ding, skin a marinky do. I love you. I love you. Ah. Uh...